Welcome to Rally Day and Jump Day on Kids Talk. I'm glad you are here. Did you know I have a pet puppet that is a fish? Yes, I do. His name is Swimmy. Oh, here he is. Hi, Swimmy. Bloop, 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 bloop. Fish don't talk, you know. But I know that Swimmy is a good little pet. And I know what he's saying to me. I bought Swimmy at a pet store and brought him home. Bloop, 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 bloop. Swimmy just swims around all day long until it's time to eat. Each day I get out the fish food and feed my pet fish Swimmy. Bloop, 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 bloop. <laughs> I think he's really cute. He's actually a clownfish. See all his little stripies and everything on there? Yeah. Well, Swimmy knows I will always feed him. I am faithful to Swimmy. Faithful means I will always take good care of Swimmy, like feeding him every day. Swimmy trusts me. He can count on me. Bloop, 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 bloop. Hey, let's give Swimmy a little fish food right now, shall we? All right, here's the fish food. Let me get, oh, he's getting all excited here. Let me get the fish food out here and ready to feed him. Ready, Swimmy? Oh, there he goes. Let's feed him. Oh, he's eating all that fish food. Oh, I might have fed him too much. I don't know. <laughs> he doesn't think so. Well, anyway, there you go, Swimmy. I'll see you later. Bye. There goes Swimmy. That was kind of fun, wasn't it? Yeah. Well, today we celebrate God's Word. Oh, and here it is. Here's the Holy Bible. There we go. We can open it up. We can touch His words. Pretty cool. So, since we're together, let's sing about God's book, the Bible. Get your hands ready. Here we go. I open my Bible book and read, God loves me, God loves me. Since, since it's such a special day, I think we should see that sing that really cool song we sing in church too. So here we go, ready? Lord, to whom shall we go? You have the words of eternal life. Alleluia. Alleluia. Today in God's book, the Bible, we read from the Old Testament, 1 Chronicles chapter 16, verse 34. Can you say chronicles? That's kind of a fun word to put on your tongue there. Chronicles. Almost sounds like a serial, but it's not. It actually is like history. It's the order in which things happened. It's a recording of it. So that's what we're going to read about here in Chronicles. And this little verse is really special, and it speaks to us today. And this is what it says. It says, oh, let me get my Bible ready. Here we go. It says, give thanks to the Lord, for he is good. His faithful love endures forever. Wow, that is really great. Okay, so our devotion for today is called... God is faithful. And I got it right here. Oh, here we go. Oh, there were just fish food flew over there. <laughs> All right, here we go. Ready for devotions? Mark went out in a boat with his dad and some of his dad's friends. Oh, look at there's a boat. The water was so blue. It was fun to look down into the water and see lots of beautiful fish swim by. One of the men lowered an anchor from the boat down into the water. What's going on? Mark asked his dad. His dad said, that big heavy piece of metal is called an anchor. Hmm. If a ship wants to stay in one place and steadfast, it sets down its anchor so the boat does not drift off to a place that people don't want to go. So let's look at that boat. See, there's the anchor right there. Can you see it? That's a little anchor. In fact, I have anchors all over my shirt today. And my necklace is an anchor. Look at that. So when they want to stay steadfast or in one place and not the boat drift off, 
they send that little anchor down in way deep and usually hits the ocean floor and the boat just stays right there in place. Isn't that neat? All right. Now, another man put on a wetsuit. Now, I have a sample here. He's like a diver guy. And this is his wetsuit he put on. Okay. And he put on some flippers. See those things right there? That's so they can swim through the water very well. And then he put some gog goggles. There's goggles right there. See? That protects his eyes. So anyway, then the man jumped off the boat into the water. There he goes. He's diving down. Is he a diver? Mark asked his father. Yes, he is, his father replied. That looks like fun, said Mark. But what happens if he has trouble and goes too deep and can't get back? Or a storm comes and he's in the water? Mark's dad answered. That would be scary. But the diver's friends in the boat would help him and save him. Hey, responded Mark, that's like Jesus. We got in trouble with all our sins, and Jesus came to rescue us by dying on the cross and rising again. That's right, Mark, said his dad. I'm so proud that you thought of that. God is so good. We can thank him for everything and trust that he will be faithful to us always. What does faithful mean, Dad? asked Mark. Mark's dad responded, God has given us many promises in his word, the Bible. He keeps them all. That's being faithful. He loves us even when we do things he does not like. That's being faithful. He provides for us and takes care of us. That's being faithful. God does what he says he will do. That is being faithful. Because God loves us so much, he is faithful to us. We can trust him. Wow, exclaimed Mark. I'm so glad God loves me and is faithful. Hey, and I know what else. An anchor is like God's word. God's word keeps our life in the right place. That's really good, Mark, his dad replied. Let's get the poles now and go fish. <laughs> that was fun. Okay, let's fold our hands and bow our head. We're going to say a prayer. Here we go. Let's pray. Dear God, you are our great and good God. Thank you for being faithful to us. We can trust you all the time. Help us to stay in your word found in the Bible. You love us so much. We love you too. Amen. Those of you from Ascension, have fun wearing your God is Faithful ocean blue wristbands. Look, I got mine on. See? After you play the beach ball game with your family. Remember to use your jump rope, like I sent to you, I mailed these to you, to jump up to your next class level. I wish we could have been together in person today for a picnic too, but that's okay. It's a blessing to be with your family. Enjoy each other. My dear friends, well, <laughs> well, <laughs> God is so good. He is faithful to us. We can trust him. Thank him for everything and stay anchored in his true word. Don't be crabby. Jesus loves you the most. And he's always with you. Tune in next week as we will meet another new friend from somewhere in the world here on Kids Talk. Goodbye, friends. Oh, keep watching to sing along with the music video that comes on next.